Good morning! Hey, good morning. It's now the third day. It's the third vlog. I slept four hours. I'm feeling good now. I took a shower. I took a poop. And now I'm feeling good. I'm gonna go to Berlin in... Oh, I don't even know. I think like in two hours. Um, but I just wanted to talk about why I am excited to do this daily vlog thing. And it's because, like... I've done vlogs and, and I've tried things like the Sunday video where I just sit down and, and, you know, talk about things and kind of recap the week. And I've tried to, you know, go fancy with the vlogs. But the problem is like the vlogs that I used to do, like it literally took me like eight hours to edit. I always wanted my vlogs to be like comedic because that's the vlogs I know. Like the, the, the Paul brothers, like... Um, David Dobrik, so I thought like to be successful for vlogs you need to be this funny character or whatever and that's maybe partly true because you know people love entertainment but that also meant that I wasn't excited anymore because I realized like sometimes I like being funny and sometimes I want to be funny and sometimes I feel like I'm funny but sometimes I don't and so um, that's why I felt like it wasn't like just authentic and so I want this vlog to be very real to be very raw to show you what I actually do throughout the day that sometimes means you know goofing around around with friends that sometimes means working on stuff that sometimes means maybe sitting down you know for for a bit and like talking about something that's on my mind it, it's really anything and everything that actually happens throughout my day um, and the the only i feel i want to do daily um and the only way for me i know myself to keep this consistent is to have these videos very raw so you'll see them they look shitty just because i know if i if i would want to do that the editing would take me so much longer and that would just keep me from actually posting them because i am not a vlogger like i'm now like starting a business that's based here in Germany and I'm building that out. Um, I'm doing all my stuff. I'm doing now events. Um, I'm doing, I'm working on some stuff with, with Willie, Willie Morris, um, and helping him out. So, so these are all things that I do. And so the vlog is just to document all of it. Um, and I want to like take you guys along the ride. Um, hopefully make these things like sometimes valuable, sometimes funny, sometimes inspirational. I don't even know. If you want to see fancy vlogs um, that are always like, you know, high energy and, and like always something like fascinating happening, this will probably not be it um, because I want to show how it actually looks like, um, you know, building, building my dream life, I guess. I'm just uploading the first video right now and then I'm gonna go to Berlin. That was a lot of rambling, wasn't it? Yo. Got all my stuff. I have six hours of bus drive in front of me and I'm gonna edit photos and edit yesterday's vlog during that. God damn it, if I'm gonna miss my bus now, I'm gonna cry. I spent way too much time reading ingredients this. I just wanted a snack for the bus drive because it's six hours. And so I ended up reading protein bars ingredients list for like five minutes. And then I ended up just buying raw nuts and fruit anyway. So I just arrived. There were two things I wanted to get done during the bus drive. Edit all the photos from the Northern Ireland trip and edit the vlog from yesterday. I only got the photos done. I didn't get the vlog done. And that kind of bothered me because like, I don't know, it still bothers me as I think I can do things quicker than I than I can and then I don't get them done and then I'm frustrated. Even though like I, I wasn't lazy, like I didn't, I still worked the whole time. Um, but now my train is also 40 minutes late and I have to get to the destination I gotta get to. And I have a consulting call in an hour, client call in an hour, so, um, I, I might not be able to make that or be late and have to like um, reschedule that but you know so I was kind of you know in that mindset they're like oh shit you know two things that are not the way I want them to be and then I realized like it's still a good fucking day I'm in Berlin now I have a camera with me 
I have a pretty open day tomorrow so I can maybe go shoot even um, so you know if I'm late to the client call like I just send an email that we can if we can reschedule for 30 minutes so that's fine I can edit the vlog later tonight you know it's just about perspective taking a step back realizing you know the things that you think kind of matter don't really fucking matter and just enjoying the day for what it is you know you know motivational thing I gotta say there definitely is some ecstasy to being in a big city alone and being on your own schedule feels nice so this is where I'm gonna sleep this is Mo's apartment he um, I knew him from like working with save the children he was so generous and allowed me to stay at his apartment and now he actually convinced me to stay another day in um, Berlin because he just had to head out for birthday so we couldn't catch up, catch up and we want to catch up so I'm gonna stay another night here So yeah, I'm going over the yesterday's vlog, I'm finishing it up, almost got it done, um, then I'm gonna export it and upload it through the night, then I'm gonna go in there because I gotta wake up at 6 in the morning tomorrow so I can get my visa, hopefully, let's hope for the best, you'll know tomorrow after this vlog. And so thank you guys for watching. I love you. Let me know what you think. And let's see you guys tomorrow. Peace. Hard to wake up when there's no alarm to wake you up. Sitting, breathing, doing all the things I hate.